Those pictures were taken in northeastern Italy, in the Prosecco area, famous for the production of the Prosecco wine. A few months ago, the UN agency UNESCO declared that this area joined the prestigious World Heritage List as a cultural landscape given the unique knowledge of nature of the local community, which perfectly blends with the surrounding natural landscape. I looked at this area through the lens of sustainable tourism, conducting content analysis of the website of 21 Agriturismo located in this area. The Italian word Agriturismo comes from the term agriculture and tourism. And these are sort of bed and breakfast with restaurants located on farms. My research question was, how do agriturismo transmit the values and the sustainability of this landscape to tourists? For my first finding, I centered on the micro level, which were the single agriturismo and their farms. And although agriturismo declared to be influenced by the trend of technology on the hospitality side, on the, for, for example, their rooms have Wi-Fi and TVs, on the hospitality, on the farming side, they declare to keep the rule of traditions. In fact, I focus on food, since the Italian national law declares that the majority of food served in agriturismo has to come from the farms where they are located. In fact, the, this agriturismo declare their food travels zero kilometers. Not bad if we think of all the pollution problems we have today. And what better way for tourists to get to know the local culture than through local food and wine. And tourists in agriturismo can attend workshops such as harvesting or jelly making, where they can have first-hand experiences of the local traditions. Secondly, for my, for my second finding, I center on the macro level. Since agriturismo declare to be part of a broader cultural context. And I invite tourists to go outside and explore those historic places such as vineyards and buildings that century after century built the identity of this place. Sociological works worldwide show that bad tourist behavior due to a shallow knowledge of the local community lead to very, very difficult social problems such as the exploitation of the local community and environmental damages. Agriturismo invites their guests to explore this area as if it was a second home, showing that a first-hand knowledge of the local community and its relationship with the environment is the first step towards a more sustainable tourism. Thank you.